Water Quality in U 2.0 is an outreach program run by Legacy Land Trust Society. Its goal is to promote voluntary land conservation, stewardship, and easements in the Little Red Deer River watershed. To date, three easements have been signed with Legacy to conserve 182 hectares along the river. The owners of the easement lands have dedicated themselves to ensuring the long-term health of their properties and are contributing to the ongoing preservation of the watershed. The Little Red is a collection point for around 235,000 hectares. More than the river, the many sloughs, creeks, wetlands and springs are an important part of the river's well-being. Fed mainly by rainfall and snowmelt, the river flows eastwards out of the foothills and then north towards Innisfail, Alberta, where it joins the Red Deer River. Stewardship practices like ensuring the river has brush and woody plants along its banks to shade the water and prevent erosion are important for improving and maintaining the health of the river. When cattails, rushes and grasses fill wetlands and drainages, they filter out sediments and excess nutrients, while offering shelter and habitat for birds, mammals and invertebrates, and preventing the incursion of noxious weeds. Proper pasture and crop management on the uplands help prevent any manure, fertilizer or chemical contamination of the waterways. The Little Red Deer River is classified as healthy with problems, which means that the previously mentioned stewardship practices are not always being met in the watershed and that there are areas for improvement. Livestock management plays a large part in keeping the river clear and flowing. Simple stewardship practices like installing a water tank fed by a solar or wind pump can immediately make an impact on the health of the river. As well, keeping animals away from the river banks protects the plants that keeps the river banks secure and reduces sediment downstream. Riparian fencing, not only of the Little Red, but also its tributaries, is important. This is why education, stewardship, and conservation are important for the entirety of the watershed, and why Water Quality in U 2.0 is reaching out to landowners who may be interested in undertaking conservation efforts of their own. When landowners enter the easement process with Legacy, they are ensuring that the stewardship practices they are already undertaking will remain in place. They are making a voluntary commitment to the health of the river, and leading by example to protect those vulnerable areas. Water Quality in U 2.0 is made possible with funding from the Watershed Resiliency and Restoration Program. Through the course of this project, Legacy hopes to connect with more landowners and develop relationships that foster the conservation of the watershed.